30-year-old Texas woman stabs boyfriend for not helping her with the bills. Yet again, another classic exemplification of female irrationality, impulsivity, entitlement, and emotional dysregulation. I've said it once and I'll say it again. Women will pick a man, date a man, be dissatisfied with that man, and do everything to hurt that man but leave that man. This woman was unhappy with the fact that her boyfriend of one year who wasn't cohabitating with her, didn't live with her, and wasn't married to her was not helping her pay her bills. And her resolution in dealing with this issue to simply try to off him. Now, I don't have any additional details on the situation. I don't even know if there was an initial agreement between him and her that he would help her pay her bills. But what I do know is that he definitely ain't going to help her do the shit now. And that's something she clearly didn't think about before she decided to take his life. Or maybe she did and thought he was useless anyway, so why not? But what I will say was extremely unsurprisingly shocking about this was the women in the comment section who were applauding the fact that she tried to kill a man because he didn't help her pay her bills and were justifying it. Free sis. Is it that bad? I understand her. Girl, I feel you. Woo. Free her. Free her because what the fuck is he doing? Free her. Free her now. This was financial self-defense. I don't care. I don't care. I feel her. She said, you're not going to stay here a lot of freeloading, but did he die though? Exactly. Free her. I felt that. Who can I connect to to get her out on bail? She did what she had to do. I would too. Good for her. That's the holiday. She innocent. Sis is frustrated, okay? And they wonder why I say women aren't built to provide. And now her level of entitlement and irrationality is about to have her sitting in prison because if she couldn't afford to pay her rent, she damn sure can't afford bail.